Hi, and welcome back. So we're now gonna get into some drills uh, where we work on many of the dynamic vision skills that we spoke about previously. Now, like all things, you gotta to learn to walk before you run. So we're gonna start off with what they call static skills. And we're gonna start off with five static skills for beginners. Then we're gonna go into intermediate skills and drills. And then finally, uh, advanced drills. And this is where you're gonna be doing a lot of movement. So uh, I think running a lot of this is gonna be uh, Ryan here. And for our very first static skill, we're going to be having Chase do an exercise. So, correct. So, we got this poster, uh, the VPX trainer poster, right up here on the wall, stuck on there. And we're going to have Chase just doing a static drill. So, we're not doing any movement right now. All we're doing is being able to use our eyes. So, Chase, as, as we do these drills, we want to be very good at the ability to keep our, eye, our head still, keeping our body still, and getting our eye movements to go here. So, as we have, look at this poster here, we have actually 50 numbers on there. Okay, and all we're gonna do is we're gonna find a series of numbers and we're gonna go by twos right now. So okay. here's what I want you to do. I want you to go to one through 50, only by twos, okay? So we'll go two, four, six, eight, and we're gonna do it under time. So are you, you ready to go? Ready. Okay, here we go, go ahead and start. And just point at them? Yep, just call, tell me what ball, how about this? Why don't you tell me, everyone's got a ball behind it, tell me what ball is behind that number. Okay. okay, here we go, go. Volleyball, basketball, football, Come on, Chase. Uh, basketball. Basketball. Baseball. Football. Okay, good. So you see it is a little challenging even not moving, but being static and being able to take in visual information and look at all these different objects. Okay, now I, I've seen your, we're going to include the dynamic training video of these drills. Now this very first drill that we did, we just did a very simple number thing. Yes. Okay, correct. just so before we start, we like to do the numbers just because it's easy? It's simple, we say they stand out, it's easy to do. Um, so what easy to do, right, Chase? <laughs> <laughs> well, it's your first time, so don't worry, Chase. Yeah, that's been static. I was on the side. I was slower than you. So, you know, I'm blaming the fact that I'm on the side, so don't worry about it. There are a lot of different ways to use it. And so, giving it to another drill right here, Chase, is what we're going to do is you're just going to go down the F column, and you're going to go up the J column. But you're going to alternate right here. Okay, so 49, 41, 33, just like that. Okay? So and go ahead and call the number out this time. And then go 33 to 19? Yep, exactly. Okay. 49, 41, 33, 19, 40, 25, 7, 37, 42, 16, 23, 24, 18, 10, 31, 50, 38, 5, 43, 35. Good. So we're just showing little eye movements, static, not moving body-wise, but just getting those eyes to be able to go up and down and take in that visual information. What are some of the visual skills that we're working on during this? Do you want to tell well, eye movements are definitely a part of it, but also the ability to lock in and let go, lock in, let go, and to be able to do it in a sequence. Sequencing is a part of it. Uh, sequencing is a visual skill, but it also becomes a cognitive skill. So, so in terms of our visual skills, it's some of the fine to right. All of soft requires, to fine. Exactly. All of this requires fine center, fine focus. Okay. And soft to fine. Also, some of the other things includes actually identifying, understanding. So we're working on a lot of our skills that we've been trying to. Yeah, and there's a level of concentration. If you lock in your focus, you can do it pretty easily. If your mind starts drifting, you're going to lose time. So that's why it's always a time drill. Uh, so you can have to recover and get right back into what you're doing. Okay, so that's uh, drill number one. Uh, we're going to be sharing a lot of great drills with you. Uh, to see more drills, go to visionforvolleyball.com.